think that I probably have always been more myself live and I just never had the opportunity to document it. And when I found out that this one particular concert we played in Germany was recorded, I was really happy because it captured a moment in time with the band completely unaware that we were being recorded. And I think that's kind of part of the magic of this record. Jonathan about a year and a half now, maybe approaching two years, and uh, I really feel like the band has become really close, really intuitive the way that uh, we're playing with each other, and um, I think that's the way to record an album. You've had a lot of time to play together and, and play the tunes in a lot of different uh, situations. I love the way that Jonathan writes um, for drummers especially because he has specific grooves but within that I can kind of be more open and still improvise and be independent in my own way. There's a lot of variety within the tunes too. Some of them are a little more in the traditional jazz and then some of them have some more rock type influences. Jonathan is a great composer. He has struck in a really great balance between things that are complex and, and kind of intellectual, but also with a really strong emotional quality. I think he does a great job balancing very intricate rhythmic uh, and harmonic things uh, with really beautiful melodies. of those two things I think is, is really effective and it makes it really fun to play on and to improvise over. One thing special about this album is that it's documenting a band that's been on the road for two years, developing a concept, developing a way to approach my music and to find their own voice within that context. And I think that it couldn't be released in any other way. A live album document that catches us on one night when we were really stretching to find some new ways of approaching these compositions that we were working with. particular group of people and people in the band uh, have a really nice uh, sound together that we've discovered. I feel like it's one of the most honest and raw things I've ever released and uh, I'm really looking forward to sharing with people.